WCBI First Alert AccuWeather Forecast with meteorologist Alex Puckett. Well, as expected, a little bit of range of temperatures as we head into the afternoon across the area. Most of us are in the 60s, but you can see in the far northwestern parts of our area, we're still in the 50s. 54 in Oxford. We're at 59 in Tupelo. I do expect Tupelo to make it in the 60s today, but sitting in also at 54 in Corinth, 57 in Iuka. So certainly a good bit cooler further off to the north and west. We're dealing with the cloud cover area wide as well. This view from Vernon, Ralph Insurance Sky Cam at Durham's Pharmacy. So it is a cloudy afternoon. We are keeping our eye on the rain. Right now, most of our area dry. This particular sort of the wide view would take the composite radar. It's overdoing things, but there is a lot of rain uh, back off to our north and west. We take the closer look at things. There are a few isolated showers out there, some rain along the Highway 72 corridor right now. We do expect this to become a little bit more widespread as we go through the rest of the afternoon. So this is the future cast model showing things right around now. It's not doing that bad of a job. As we go through the rest of the afternoon, we'll see showers become a little bit more widespread, especially as we head into the late afternoon and into the evening hours. Temperatures going to be topping out in the mid 60s in the Golden Triangle region. And again, we'll see more scattered showers as we go through the rest of the day today. Today is going to be opening day for Mississippi State and Ole Miss baseball. There is going to be that chance for showers, though, as we head through the evening. So you're going to want to plan for rain both in Starkville and in Oxford if you're heading out to enjoy one of these games. We'll be in the 60s through uh, the uh, game in Starkville, in the 50s, though, in Oxford. It'll be north and west of the front there, so a little bit cooler at Vaught Hemingway. That front going to push down to our south as we go through the rest of the day today and into tonight. As we head into tomorrow, an isolated shower, not out of the question but mainly dry and cool. That front lifts back to our north Saturday night, though, so for Sunday, we'll be warming right back up. As we head into next week, heavy rain and a lot of it on the way, it looks like. This is just one forecast model. It's not gospel, but I wanted to show you this. This particular model showing from today into the weekend. Rainfall totals generally anywhere from a half an inch to an inch and a half, but then a lot of rain falls as we head into the work week next week. We could certainly see some rainfall totals in the three to five inch range, and there's some indication we could get higher than that in some spots. So flooding, not out of the question as we head into next week with a lot of rain on the way. Temperatures in the 60s today, 50s Saturday, back into the 60s Sunday, and then we'll be in the 50s as we end the work week next week. We got a couple of furry friends here in the studio. It's Friday. That means Pets Without Partners is coming up. Uh-oh, he's making a run for it. Pets Without Partners right after this.